Hello there, here it is, our eight month review of the Swift Caravan Sprite Major 4 EV. We have been living in it, let me just, here it is. Not all the time, but all over the last eight months we have always re lived in it. It is now standing in a barn, which helps because as you know, Scottish weather can look like that. Rainy, windy, and it's a good thing to, to be able to leave the muddy boots outside of the caravan. Well, what I can tell you is that I'm still really happy with the layout of the caravan. Inside, you have... <laughs> There I am again. Two two doors, this one, and then there are two more doors you can close, which makes it really a two two room apartment. So somebody can be sleeping behind there, and the second person might be on the couch or working, as you can see, in the living room. This is a really good thing. What I also like a lot about it is that there are so many windows when well when not you're not in a barn but outside you can see really the, the lovely landscape or the night sky which is a good thing too what i also like about it is that you can make make it really well illuminated there are many lamps that help you uh, see what you need to see. What I don't like so much about the lamps is that there is no real lighting for, for the evenings. It's always very bright and disturbing so there's nothing to just uh, hang around if you don't really need a lot of, of light. But yeah you can help yourself with uh, candles or other lamps so that's not a problem. Um, what else did I want to tell you? Give me a so what I also like about it is that there's quite a lot of, of space to, to store stuff. We really don't use all of it yet, so it's a good thing. You can get a lot of stuff stored. And what I also like, which is important for me because I'm always feeling cold, is as soon as you turn the heating on, it gets warmer very fast. That's good. And also the insulation seems to be okay. Doesn't get cold all too too fast again. Um, what I could show you is the shower. The shower is really, really quite huge. I mean, I don't know if you can see that, but I can stand in it. I'm, I'm really I can turn around, I can wash my hair, have enough space. So good, good shower for the caravan and um, and also in the kitchen you have quite a lot of space to work the only strange thing is that they did um, give you a separate table with the caravan and the caravan uh, the, the table they gave you don't have the same height or doesn't have the same height as the the table inside the caravan so you have like two different heights of tables which doesn't make sense, but isn't, isn't a problem, really. What really is bothering me more is that the, the thermostat rated here doesn't show you the right temperature. This one says 18 degrees, and if you look, it really is only 14 and something Celsius. It always is way, way higher than the, the real thing. Yeah. And well, the, the bed is, I think, two meters, and that's quite short for tall people, but you can manage. And also, there's like this internal radio that will turn on automatically every time you turn on electricity and will just burn down the battery. And we really don't use it. We have a, another this little speaker so it's, it's really just using battery for nothing that's something that's not good and 
what we also miss, there are very few plugs. We you could really do with much more plugs. There's one plug at the entry, one in the bedroom, two in the kitchen and one in the living room. So if you are two, you have two phones, a laptop and maybe something else you want to charge, you're out of plugs very fast. And one last thing. Oh yes, the mat, the when we when you enter the foot mat can't be taken out. So if you, it would be so much easier to just take it and just get the, all the, the dirty stuff outside, but you can't, so you always have to hoover it, which is, well, I would have done it differently, anyways. And last thing, oh yes, it is on only one hmm, axle, if you say axle, which means that it's, it rocks a lot. As soon as somebody moves inside, the whole thing is shaking. And, well, I sometimes I really feel like on a boat. And if you have a not if you don't have the stomach for it, it's not such a good thing. I think you could maybe st stabilize it a little more if, if you don't want to move it around a lot, but still it's not a not a good thing. But I have to say that all in all, for what it cost us, which wasn't that much, it's a very good caravan. It's it has a lot of space. We could just live in it without any problem. There you go, our eight month review of the Swift Caravan Sprite Major E4 something.